Pre-flight checks, surgery centers complete. E-tower complete. It's the nation's newest airline. M239 payload box locked. Transport to surgery center flight plan loaded. Like the ones we all fly, but this is the FAA's first ever fully certified airline with no one in the cockpit. All the aircraft drones. We can operate from multiple locations. With Sherry multiple Roberts, commercially rated a Navy veteran who flew spy drones in Afghanistan. Now the chief pilot of the company, best known for its brown delivery trucks. It's kind of humbling to be at the beginning of the next generation of aviation. With 16 scheduled flights a day, drones ferry tissue and blood samples across the sprawling 50-acre Wake Med Hospital campus in Raleigh. Flight time? Under three minutes. The old system, it could take hours to get over here. Doctors say they now rely on it. Anytime you're dealing with care of a patient, time is a factor. UPS and CVS now working to one day fly prescription drugs to your house. It's kind of trite, but the sky is the limit with drones. And, and that's potentially me being the package and UPS picking me up and taking me to work. I gotta say, we need a bigger drone. <laughs> <laughs> Drones pushing the envelope again. Kerry Sanders, NBC News, Raleigh. Hey, NBC News fans, thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Subscribe by clicking on that button down here and click on any of the videos over here to watch the latest interviews, show highlights, and digital exclusives. Thanks for watching.